This is Outdated, and welcome to the next episode of Back Catalog. And in this episode, I'm playing a game I've been wanting to play on here for quite a while, but every time I try to do it, it seems to be doing an update, because it always seems to fall on a Tuesday or a Wednesday, and I hadn't been on there, so... Um, but it is Hearthstone. Um, it's a collectible card game set in the Warcraft universe, and it's just addictively fun and silly as crap. Um, so, real quick, um, I've got 2,955 whatever these are called, gold, I can buy like 29 packs if I wanted to. I'm waiting for the next set to come out, but I've got these missions I have to do. You get one free every day, and when you get them, you get more gold. Um, three games as a mage, rogue, or shaman. Uh, play 30 cards, or use your hero power 20 times. I've started the progress of all of these. I'm going to use a mage on this first game, and see if I can put a dent in it. So I'm just going to go to regular play, and I'm going to do it in the casual circuit instead of the hardcore one, because... To be honest, this mage deck I have kind of sucks. So, um, let's see, um... So, here we go. The mage was always my favorite class for some reason on here, but, um, I've been playing a lot of the others lately, but it is wanting me to do this one specifically. It also has a lot of, um, single-player content that you get over time, that you can just play on your own, but you don't get the, um... In most cases, you don't get the rewards for it. You don't get the quests. You have to actually play real people to get the quests. So we're going to be going up against an opponent. So this deck is very spell heavy. Jaina! Um, I'm using a mage. Rexa. They're using a hunter. Let's the hunt begin. I'm looking at what I have here. For it. Okay. I'm definitely not going to keep deep breathing just because it's very expensive at 8. I'm not going to cast that 8 times soon. See if I get something cheaper, and I did. Good. All right, let's see. And what did I draw? Questing adventure. All right, I am not going to cast it. Let's wait and see what they do. Next turn? Yeah, okay, there it is. I'm going to drop this guy. I like using Job done. characters that, um, it was no different than my philosophy when I would play Magic Gathering back in the day. Uh, using cards that people want to get rid of as soon as possible because they know it'll be a massive pain in their butt. And this card is one of those. And now, yeah, they only have two deadly shots. Honestly, a card that's not that great. Especially when they would probably oh, rather sell this guy. The fire or this guy. So we're going to wait. See what he does. Acquiring system. All right. Here we go. Okay, this is gonna get me. Um. Okay, we're gonna start by using this. Yet, I'm just gonna wait. Let's see what he does. Dropping another one of those guys. Not quite the same, but still. Okay, let me think here. Alright, I'm gonna drop him. Give me a quest. Every time I drop any card, he gets bigger. Whenever I drop a spell, he does two damage randomly split. I'm gonna drop her, which will make him bigger and just lower like the cost of this. Then I'm going to do this. Which eliminated him. Oh, and it goes through the Darn it. Alright, well. I'm still keeping the pressure on. Got an advantage for now. Two damage. Summon a hero to go. I wonder what this does. Um, Death Rattle, Dirty Dirty Enemy Hero. Okay, so let's do this. Blizzard just took a I need to call my ball either, and I'll just smack it in five. Let's keep going, keep putting the pressure on. See if we can get one of these quests resolved. One of them, though, is using my hero power, and I'm not doing it that much. Your death rattle should trip off twice. Nice plan there, dude. Very nice plan. 
I also have a plan. Let's see if it works. Quest accepted. And eliminate the creature. Oh, we should have hit him head on. But I wanted to get that thing off the board. Strap in! It's got to be at last! Those bombs are going to throw at me, dude. How many? Okay, we're going to do this. This, which freezes all of them. We're gonna ping him for one. Quest accepted. So he can't kill my uh, or protect himself somehow. It's over. Let's see. I also have two, three there. Ah, that could do it. Because there's Watch one that will bounce it back to our hand. Have. That could definitely mess me up. Trigger all death rattles. Ouch. And they're all gonna hit me, and they're all gonna hit me. Uh, well played, well played. Very well played. The better to eat you with. Right back in the game, that didn't take him long. Let's see if I've got anything useful. Do that. Yeah, let's, um... Let's see if I can get through with that. Quest accepted. So that one's not even that one. This is good. I think it's good. The longer games might hit maybe 20 minutes, 25. Alright, I'm very close with getting the cards. I've got one more with Mage, Rogue, or... I think I'll try a different deck this time. I'll go with the Rogue. And that will finish that quest for sure. So, like, I'm... I haven't, I mean, I kind of go off and on playing this game. When it came out, I played it, because generally I've played everything Blizzard makes, because I can't think of a bad game they've ever made. All the way back to the original Warcraft, or to Orcs vs. Humans, I can see. And I've been playing their stuff ever since. Um, I'm not an MMO guy, but, you know, World of Warcraft is the MMO. I mean, they even mastered that. To the point where they actually had to release the original version, Valir and the other versions. Turanda! Because their fan bases are so big in both. Give me strength. You know, they still Watch dominate the rankings. Your this deck, deck I don't use very often. It's more like I can just get the quest done. But Rogue is not a class I like to use that much, honestly. I need to probably get better at that. So I'm going to probably start by dropping the cat here. Discover a copy of Minion. Huh. Nice card back. It's like a lemonade. Or perhaps a adult beverage. I can't really tell, but I'm gonna assume it's lemonade. We're gonna go with that. All right, here we go. I'm gonna drop this guy. Got a random reborn mini here. What is it? A two-two reborn mech. Okay. Which I can just drop next turn. All right. Let's see if he drops anything. He did. Well, that looks good. Here. Okay, I think I just figured out my plan. Oh, that's good. Do I want to hold off on that then? Um, first off, let's uh, let's go face. Do that. So, this deck is mostly all about getting Galakron into play. Um, that card will let me draw. I want to have enough mana if I get that far. Using that 1, 2, don't die guy, not bad. Um, okay, I need to. Let's see. Battlecry, transform a friendly minion into a 1 that costs 1 more. Um, sure, we'll do that. Transform that. Okay, nice, nice. Um, I'll drop this. Okay. okay, I'm waiting until I have a lot more cards in my hand so that I can drop a bunch of nuts so I can play 
Edwin Van Cleef because he gets bigger with every card I play in a turn. And this card right here is one you need for him to work well. So I could drop him. Hmm. You know what I have done is I need to do this. So each class has its own skill that I can do, like um, it's usually sitting right here. Um, it usually costs two. Uh, the priest, which is what they're using, um, heals two, restores two health to, well, pretty much anything. Um, hmm, let's see, Rush, Malachi, Evoke, Um, hmm. Let's just go ahead and get the attacking out of the way. Do not shoot. <laughs> Go ahead and prepare ahead and drop him. Head the flesh for the dragon. Use it a different way. Uh, why not? Use the two cross minions. Here we go. Wow, what's this thing do? At the end of your turn, restore four health to your hero. Oh, thank you. That's a good example of a card that they're going to want to get rid of. And I've got a pretty full board, and they have very little. But the priests are very <laughs> Like that 2 6 taunt thing is gonna be a pain in my booty. Alright, um. Turn to friendly me to see. Let's see how I wanna do this. What's this at? Reborn? No. Destroy a random enemy minion. That would suck. Alright, we're gonna do this. Do not shoot! Ooh, he doesn't kill it. Do this. <laughs> That and hope he doesn't kill some ass. Yeah. Oh, well, that sucks. Okay. <laughs> it is what it is. Alright, let's see. What do I want to do here? Damaged character. Hmm. We're going to drop this bad boy. You are too late. This return is not. There we go. Okay, now what is this 03 guy? Still for one turn after friendly minion dies, shuffle up. And that's what's going to drop so this. So I need to eliminate that thing as quickly as possible. The best way I know how. Let's, um. Well, first, let's. Violation! <laughs> We can have him, that's fine. Now we're going to mm, do that. Oh, come on. I'm not a big fan of that ability. And invoke Galakron, he just got in invoked. Okay, this is well. I'm going to drop him. From nothing. Power! Discovering a spell. We're gonna go with cold blood. Alright, we're going to get more of an attack. Are you kidding me? That was way... That, that was way faster than it should be. At least it felt like it to me. Greetings! All that was a Mistakes were made. Van Cleef. And it didn't work. Let's see if I can get through this again. It's finished. Oh, you they gave up. Okay. Well played. I think I started. Yeah, that was four. That's nice. Okay. 
Okay. So I think based on this, and you've seen me play two games with two different classes, uh, I think we are good here. I am going to check real quick and see if they have added a new set yet. I know there's one. I think there's one coming out soon. Um, they're all pre-purchased, so they're not out yet. Okay. So I'm going to do one more thing. I think I'll do solo adventure. And we'll let that be it for this episode. So the solo adventures is I'm going to show you that there are a ton of them. They've come out over time. You start with practice. Uh, the most recent is Ashes of Outland. But you go back to Galakrond's Awakening, Tomb of Terror, Dalaran Heist, Ristagun Rumble. I'm going to show my way too fast there, didn't I? The Boomsday Project. The Witchwood, The Frozen Throne. Which is my favorite so far. Karaskan, League of Explorers, Black Rock Mountain, Nexramas. You get cards with all of them as you complete stuff. It's just really, really fun. See, I was working on this one. And I think I was here. Yeah, I was. Now take up arms, my chosen few. You'll train as demon hunters do. So Shalja and Arana Spar learning the ways of the demon. So it plays out a story between these various characters, and the characters uh, come from, at least most of them, come from uh, World of Warcraft or Warcraft 4 that you interact with and stuff. It's really, really cool. But the game itself, it's like, if you've ever played Magic the Gathering, it's kind of like that, but easier to learn, which is saying something Arana! I would say just this as hard, or at least close to master. Um, there's just so many cards. Okay, Shalja. Don't go easy on me. Uh, Lady Arana, I never yeah, hold like anything so back. Easily. I mean, like, just finishing a couple of quests, which are done for free, will get you a pack, usually. Um, winning your tavern brawl once a week will get you a pack. Usually you get packs just for starting to play. Um, so, I don't feel like it's that bad. Okay, let's see, what are we going to start with? How many? One mana, huh? Arana, your prowess in combat is impressive. I could never beat my sister. She was competitive in everything. Okay, I'm gonna drop this. Oh my god, I need to get that damage in while I can. Okay, they didn't do anything. Kinda of surprised, but okay. Um. I'm gonna drop this. That makes it a 3 2. And whack him for 3. That's their ability. Passive hero power after you play a card with overlay. Missed a. What? Missed it. Your Passive training begins. Spell. Reach deep down. All you've suffered. Turn it round. Can you be aggressive? That goes, King's Bane goes right back into my deck. Now, these single player games, I could use a sometimes thing. you're using your own decks, sometimes you're not. Sometimes you're using decks they built for me. Like this, these are decks they built for me. Okay. Okay, going through damage on a minion doesn't help when nobody has a minion. Um, let's discover a demon. Oh lord. Look at three cards in your deck. Choose one to put on top. Can't take heroes. Taunt at the end of your turn. Summon a demon from your deck. I don't know if I even have demons in my deck, but we're gonna go ahead and go with that even though I'm gonna play it for quite some time. We're gonna drop another one of these back. Wait. That one it was outcast. If I cast it when it's at the far right or far left of my hand, I get a better benefit, which is drawing a card. And I got this, which has combo. Um, normally the two mana would do two damage, but because I've cast something this turn, it'll do four instead. So I'm gonna go ahead and. Better together! Man, as much as I 
much as I hate to because I'm not sure what the point is, I'm gonna go ahead and hit him. Boomerang, throw your weapon at no. I don't want to hurt Shalja too badly. And we will. Okay, next turn. You cannot break the broken. Lifestyle. The good news is this guy's gonna wake up and probably automatically attack him. No, he gets a bypass. Nice! That's awesome. That is awesome. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and eliminate this. He does get some. Um, we're gonna go ahead and get together. here. Gotta go! Here. Exact same card, we're going to drop it. You cannot break the broken. Right, we might be able to win this thing. Kill one damage to an enemy minion. Or to all enemies. Boy, I don't that. The good news is, oh crap, never mind. I thought I had a beat, but I don't. That's a Ouch. Really? This is what I did the last time it I played. It burns my veins! Oh, I think I just won. We all have demons. Oop. Let yours out. Feel its power as your horns sprout! Let's get rid of that thing. I think it's gonna be a pain in my boots. Holy <laughs> be my shield! Toss three of there. And fifty. I am faster! Stronger! Are you? So we're not done? Oh crap, we're not done. All my life, God. I've struggled to see my purpose, calling, why I'm me! But with his help, I'll cleanse these wastes! I'll change this world! Yes! That's my place! Notice the rhyme scheme they're using. Ooh, what? Oh, did I just become something awesome? Oh, that was it. Yeah, it cool. So, um, I can't stress enough how fun the game is. It gives you different things to do. Um, using the same cards. Um, like this story that I'm going through. Um, if I were to go back, you'd see this was part one. There's four battles you're gonna go through. Part two, four battles. Part three has four, and I'm on the second one. Part four, part five only has one because it's the big one at the end. Um, so let's go back here, and you'll see this through a lot of these. And you can go in a challenge. Come in, where my friend. Really and Begin the like show. Depending on what it is. A tale of fire so that's and player. strife also, um, and woe. There's also modes. And in modes, you can go to the battleground, which is a beta. It's a really unique gameplay thing where there's eight different players playing against each other, and you're matched up against one of the player and they are two girls broken up into like pairs and you fight each other for a round and then you go back and you purchase new minions then you fight somebody else randomly chosen for a round and in the arena you draft a 30 card deck from scratch and then you know win what fight and win for a reward so then you've got that you have the tavern brawl which changes every week I just one more thing for this video but um, this one I built this specific ball deck. Sometimes it gives you one. Sometimes you build it yourself. It depends on what the parameters are. They change every week and they are a blast. Then there's the solo adventures, and then there's play, um, which I showed you earlier, and um, where you have casual and then you have ranked play, and you can build up ranks and get different rewards and stuff like that. Um, and just to see you have an idea of how long this game's been around and what kind of sets we're talking about. You have um, Ashes of Outland, Descent of Dragons, Saviors of Olden, Rise of Shadows. This is the base Hearthstone set, so these are always usable. Um, then you have some others in the back. Um, or I said that's already denied. Uh, Rusticon's Rumble, The Boomsday Project, The Witchwood, Kobolds and Catacombs, Knights of the Frozen Throne, Journey of Ungro. 
um, mean streets of uh, gadgets on. Uh, then there's an adventure here, Whispers of the Old God. That one's inspired by Cthulhu. Um, this was an adventure here. Then there's the Grand Tournament, another adventure, and Goblins and Gnomes. And then you have this set here, which is an adventure. Goblins and Gnomes, I think, was the first set from year one. So you see there's been a lot of expansions. And we have a new one coming out pretty soon. This, uh, whatever this one's called. Skullamance Academy. And you can prepay now to get stuff. But you can't use points on that, so I'm not messing with it. Uh, I, you know, this game's completely free. I don't spend a penny. Um, but if I wanted to, I could go get a card and buy a card just because it's such a good game. It gives me a lot of enjoyment. Um, but I hope you enjoyed this episode of Back Catalog. Um, if you did, please like and subscribe. I'm going to continue to try some different stuff. I think in the next episode I'm going to do something older. Maybe an old 360 or original Xbox game. Uh, maybe... Tom Clancy's Rainbow Six Vegas. That would be a good one. I've been thinking about doing that one anyway. It's been installed and waiting for me to do. So maybe I'll do that one for the next episode. Um, but I hope you enjoyed it, and I will see you next time. Peace. Out.